Right. Uh, I think that's recording. <clears throat> this is the data record of Dr. Stephen Fernier. I've spent three months deep in the Amazon rainforest searching for the elusive creeping banana spider. And today, I've tracked one to its lair, high above the treetops. This web strand acts like a tripwire, alerting our eight-legged friend to the presence of intruders who soon become the spider's next meal. Because the wandering predator is the most venomous creature in the rainforest. Ha-ha! <laughs> Not today, little friend. I've been expecting you. But I wasn't expecting you! <laughs> the venom is very quick acting, but, but it's all right. Of course, I have anti-venom. Oh, 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 oh. I need to administer it accurately. Already hard to keep my hands steady. Oh dear. Mayday! Mayday! This is Dr. Bernier. I've been bitten by a creeping banana spider. Need anti-venom. This is Rio General Hospital, Jungle Outpost 14. We read you, Dr. Fernier, sending you our last vial of anti-venom on a drone. Good thing we had it in stock. Would take 48 hours to get another one. I don't want to be dramatic, but I won't last 48 minutes. situation. Five, four, three, two, one. Spanner. Pocket fuser. How's the T-drive engine going? For fine. We're making good progress. Uh-huh. What's this part you're working on here? <sighs> engine coolant circuit. The very delicate. Okay, all right. And how long will that take? A lot longer if you keep interrupting us. I'm not interrupting, I'm observing. I want to make sure everything's being put together right. You still don't trust me. Can you blame me? How do we know you're really here to help us? The cybernetic link the hood planted in the mechanic's brain is broken. You know that, Scott. We need to focus on putting this engine together so we can find your father. I built the original T-Drive engine, and I've been waiting years for a chance to rebuild it. But I can't work with you breathing down my neck. Well, I'm waiting to rescue my dad. Scott, we all want the same thing. And that the best way you can help right now is be patient and let us work. I can't handle just waiting around, not able to do anything. Why don't you come with us? We're on our way to the Amazon rainforest. Simple search and recovery mission to deliver some anti-venom. But we have to hurry. Hurrying is good. And this is just what Scott needs to keep him out of the way. I mean, take his m mind off all this waiting. I guess you're right. Okay, I'm in.
number two is go. Last connector in place. And the drive coupling is secured. Truly, this engine is a thing of beauty. A m masterpiece. Thank you, Max. But we won't know for sure until we fire it up. And there's one small problem. No fuel. At this m moment, yes. But Lady Penelope and Parker are on their way to pick up Centurium 21 fuel cells from my old friend... Professor Moffat, lovely to see you again. Your new research facility is truly remarkable. Please, calm me, Murphy. Everyone does. Thank you, Murphy. And for your help. Anything for Hiram. I mean, brains. <laughs> You're also helping me. You've given me an excuse to miss a charity mystery dinner party, where the guests have to solve a pretend crime. It's very dull. Always the butler who did it. Typical of the prejudice against butlers, Melody. Here we are. It's gone. All of it. Stolen. Looks like you've headed up with a mystery after all, Belady. I have the coordinates of where the drone with the anti-venom was last in contact. You'll need to configure an Earth pod. The dragonfly should be best for getting around the jungle. FAB. This big bug should blend in with all the other insects. Don't. I have a thing about a particular bug that I really don't want to run into. Oh. Hey, wait. Is it spiders? Because, you know, this whole mission is because of a spider, right? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> Stand by, Scott and Kale. We're nearly there. We'll find the drone, grab the anti-venom, and meet you at Dr. Fernier's base as fast as we can. FAB, I'll do my best to stabilize him, but you need to hurry. Clock is ticking. I'm picking up a weak signal from the drone, but it's below the treetops. The jungle's too dense for us to fly through. Land on that tree and I'll climb down. You can stay in the pod so you don't run into any bugs. I'm fine. There's one small thing that creeps me out, but it's no big deal. It's spiders, isn't it? I said I don't want to talk about it, so just drop it. I think we're about to. All those mystery dinners have made me quite good at finding clues. I bet the burglars cut the wires to the alarm system. <laughs> No, Melody, I already checked. The wires are untouched, and there's no sign of forced entry. Hmm, just like the case of the locked vault at the last mystery dinner. Only a handful of my most trusted staff have the security codes to open the vault. Well, we'll need to question them, because this was an inside job. Maybe the butler did it after all. Oh. Dr. Fernier? International rescue, I presume. At your service. I'm going to transfer you to the medical bay on Thunderbird 2 while two of our team pick up the anti-venom. Everything's gonna be fine. So long as they get here in time. Wings are gone. Apart from that, there's not too much damage. Okay, so it won't fly, but we can still travel on the ground. No need. Look. Race you. Kao, we don't have time for childish games. I'm sorry, I didn't mean... Besides, you'll never beat me. <laughs> See you at the top. <laughs> what were you saying? About seeing you at the top. Okay, you win. But watch out, these branches are dry and rotten. Remember what happened with that pod. So far, so good. This branch seems solid enough to take our weight. Got it! Oh, you have got to be kidding! A leaf? That's enough to... Oh! everything you 
doing, but the venom is spreading too fast. I can't feel my legs. I'm afraid we're running out of time. The anti-venom will get here, I promise. Scott? Ko, Where are you? Uh, note to self, next time, bring a jetpack. What happened to the drone? Must be at the bottom. Hold on, I'm coming to you and we'll figure out a way to get down. <laughs> K.O. <laughs> Scott, K.O., do you read me? We need that anti-venom. Uh, a little busy right now, Virgil, but we're on it. Uh, maybe I can make my way back to the cliff face along the branch. Huh? Or maybe not. I think I can swing to that ledge. Whoa, easy. One more try. Okay, but now what? Uh, I have a plan. Here, boy. Oh, nice work, Kale. Uh oh, uh, hurry. So, a simple search and recovery mission, huh? Whew. After talking to everyone who had security codes to the vault, I believe we've found our thief. Absolutely. And it's Dr. Ballantyne. Uh, no, Melody? Right, well, of course, but it's between him and Thompson, head of security. She had a watertight alibi, Melody. Well, then who? I'm usually very good at this. <gasps> you don't mean... The last person anyone would suspect. <gasps> no, Belady. It's Iggy's. He was going to be my next guess. When I questioned him, he was very nervous, and his eye twitched the same as Frenchie Jackson, a burglar of my <coughs> former acquaintance, whenever he was brought in by the coppers. Higgins has been with me for years. I can't believe he'd steal anything. Centurium 21 is very valuable. You'd be surprised what great sweet old men will get into when there's money at stake. I went through the computer logs and found a coded message arranging a meeting for the sale. If I'm right about Higgins, he's going to want to leave here any minute to get to that rendezvous. Right on cue. <laughs> Excuse me, Professor Moffat, but do you mind if I head off early today? I... <coughs> I'm not feeling too well. So long as you don't have any more questions for me. No, you go right ahead. We're all finished here. Why didn't you stop him? He's getting away. No, he's not. He's going to lead us right to the Centurium 21, isn't he, Parker? Yes, Belady. Huh, look! We finally had some luck. And we should have just enough time to get it to Virgil. I think I know what's happening. The drone sensors got damaged in the waterfall. Now it's reading us as a threat and taking evasive action. Yeah, we'll evade this! I've been through this once before. We won't get near it. Scott, Kale, 
Dr. Fernier is getting worse. Where are you? I'm calculating how fast that venom is spreading. It's not looking good. We need that anti-venom now. Is that thing mocking us? I have an idea. That drone is a total dodgeball champ. You'll never hit it. I'm not trying to hit it. I want it to attack me. And that's good because... Because you'll be waiting. Virgil, we've hit a snag. How much time do we have? Not enough. I'm seeing if I can use any meds to slow down the venom, but that will only buy us a few extra minutes. You'd better take this before I drop it. Thank you. You saved me. I promise we're going to return the favor. Scanners show Higgins just ahead. Engage in stealth mode so we can get into position, Melody. Hello? It's Higgins. Anyone there? That's far enough. I've got the Centurion 21. Slide it over. What about my payment? You said this would make me rich. You'll get what's coming to you. We'll exchange on three. One, two, three. <coughs> Pleasure doing business with you. Hey, old man. <gasps> Is that the Centurion 21? No. I already... I already gave it to you. This is my payment. What are you talking about? I just got here! But then, who did I swap cases with? Oh, no. Oh. Ah! You really fooled the kids, lady. Oh, thank you. Parker. If we hurry, we can deliver the Centurion 21 to Brains and get you to the charity mystery dinner on time. I think we'll just send them a donation this time. After all, we've had a theft from a locked room, questioned suspects, and I went undercover. I'd say that's enough mystery for one day. Yes, the lady. <laughs> That's it! Come get some! Here we go! Now, K.O.! There. <laughs> Done. Virgil, we got the anti-venom. But I don't know if we can get to you in... <sighs> Time! I figured it'd be quicker if I came to you. The anti-venom is already working. You'll be good as new in no time. We'll still take you to Rio General Hospital, just to be completely sure. Thank you all so much. I know you all went through a lot to get me that anti-venom. Let's make sure we return our little friend here to the hospital. I'll leave it by the sample jar. Ah. <gasps> the spider! Oh, I must not have put the lid on properly. No one move! It's okay. I found the little guy trying to crawl away. I thought you were afraid of spiders. No, I told you I wasn't. Then what? I'll never tell you. You'll laugh. Oh, come on. I won't. Is it millipedes? Grasshoppers? Stick insects? Butterflies? <gasps> Wait, butterflies? That's what you're afraid of? 
<laughs> you said you wouldn't laugh. <laughs> Butterfly. Apparently I was wrong. <laughs> it's not funny. Their wings are too fluttery and they have really weird faces. <laughs> oh, 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 I have to tell Virgil. Don't you dare. You know I can make you regret it. You're kidding me. Butterflies? Butterflies! <laughs> <laughs>